Um, this was how the color turned out the last time we were with Tamika. And what we're correcting is this, what looks like fuchsia or like violet red. We were trying to go for a blue violet, but Pravana's locked in purple is extremely deceptive. So if you plan on using it, I would tell you, don't bother unless you want a pink purple. If you want a blue base purple, it's not gonna work. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna use the violet that I probably should have used from the beginning to go through all those strands from her root to like the mid strand. And since I'm familiar with the violet because it's in my hair, it's gonna turn a lot of this teal that you guys see, the teal and the green, should end up turning blue so it'll wash through all of this. And that should do the trick. And we'll probably take a little bit of lightener to the ends just to wash that out since it's probably gonna be a little bit darker than we want it to be. And then it might not be, but we're just gonna take some precautions. Um, if you're in the Renton, Seattle area, just know that if we do a color, if it doesn't look good, I'm definitely gonna have you come back at no extra charge within like the first seven days and clean it up because my name <laughs> is important to me. And even though she got a lot of compliments, I just think it could look a lot better. So we're gonna get started because she has places to go and things to do in her life. So you guys just tune back in when we get done with the color and you can check it out and tell me if you think it came out awesome. We're kind of going for, for this, this purple and blue. It'll probably be a little bit more vibrant, but that's our goal. So we will see you shortly. Okay, there we go. Woo, okay. So if you guys tuned in earlier, you know that all of this was magenta when I meant it to be purple and I was using Pravana's purple locked in which by many of the reviews does not come out purple at all but it comes out red or pink. So I went back through with Pravana's violet in their Vivids line and went through the root and mid strand and I thought some of it was gonna wash out into her teal, but it didn't. So, basically we got exactly what we were looking for. We got nice rainbow hair and a pretty ombre that I'm excited about. And that I have no problem with her saying that I did it. Because <laughs> before I was like, don't tell nobody that was me. You guys can see the dimension and the transition. So if you know by anybody in the Renton or Seattle area who's looking for change for the fall and they want to get daring, have them reach out to me at 206-992-7905. Hey you guys, bye.